All right. Um, it's uh, working on the U mods robot. It's one twenty-seven twenty-thirteen. It's eleven thirty-eight p.m. Um, so interesting thing just happened. I'm uh, writing the code here, and uh, I just it's uh, I'm using the uh, Visual Studio Adreno plugin. Uh, Visual Studio 2012 and uh, got my code here 96 baud um, Define my variables set up find the output pins here um, And then I got this uh, serial read-in that assigns the first variables, you know the Character that's coming in as you can see right here. I was sending a forward and uh, I got some logic here that basically says if it's F or back, B backward, L left, R right, S for stop. And I just have um, a drive that I'm testing out. It appears I don't need it, but anyway. Um, I, I kind of play with this logic of this slow down and speed up. That way I don't... I don't... Uh, force too much current through all the wires and they burn up um, you know because the sudden start and stop of the motors just save the motors a little bit that instantaneous um, step function versus a ramp so I'm trying to make it a ramp input versus a step input and uh, you know stop functions for blah 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 well what happened was just now is that I had sent this F and uh, you know, I just I'm just connecting this cable here as a battery and just holding it here. Um, but uh, this cable got wrapped around this wire, stalling the motors. Uh, of course, you know it's going to be a whole bunch of current. Unexpectedly, though, and I haven't tried to run this again. I got to replace the wires that my uh, I believe this is my power. No, this is my ground wire. My ground wire just fried. It was smoking in it. And I'm concerned. Oh good, it didn't short it out. Um, didn't go all the way through. I was worried that it actually melted those and joined those together. But it looks like it didn't. Uh, this wire is totally shot. I wouldn't expect that though. Um, you know, the capacitors and the and the... My drivers, they're, they're still a little bit colder to the touch. Um, didn't expect this. And also look at the, uh, the data sheet for this VNH2SP3D. Um, I don't know, this is a control pin. I wouldn't have thought it would have had any feedback um, apparently it did so I'm just gonna have to make sure that when I you know at the next stage I allow for these things to get stalled out and it you know I know that the uh, the chips themselves they have over um, amperage and over temperature protection um, they only allow they, they have a cutoff at 30 amps um, and that's also unique with this chip that it also runs motors up to 30 amps, but um, it's supposed to cut it off and it didn't uh, So yeah, I didn't expect this I'll have to investigate why this happened. It really Fried the heck out of it. All right. Um, that's my update for tonight